Welcome to Banana Man's Fire. Today, I'm doing the conclusion of the Jimmy Pickles powders. I've got the chocolate primatale and the jigsaw red. What the fuck? Wow, wow. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. So yes, the conclusion. I'm just going to get the rest of these done here. Um, I've got two chinenses. The chocolate primatale, which I am excuse us real quick. We're back. He doesn't want to stay up. Um, so the chocolate primatale I am growing. Um, I actually have these seeds going now. I have tried a little bit of this powder. I am not necessarily the biggest fan of the flavor, but we will get into that. Um, still a really cool pod. I'll see if I'll, I'll get, I'll try to get some better photos and see if, uh, see if Jimmy can do that. So real quick, again, I'm, oh, I'm off camera here. Sorry. Real quick. Uh, Jimmy was nice enough to send me these just to review. He does not sell powder. He does giveaway powder with seeds when he has it. So keep that in mind. Um, always gives away free seeds. Isolated grows. I will show all his stuff right now. And yeah, so the chocolate primatale. I have tried this powder. I have tried this pepper very immaturely and should not have tried it um whatever i'm not, not i'm not a huge fan of the flavor uh but we will get to that and i will try it the jigsaw red um never had a jigsaw red so i'm excited for this one these are both chinenses and these are both from the 2020 harvest obviously and so not going to be the 2021 i've got a little bit of water here and the Splurgeon Sturgeon. Shout out Keith Nichols. Thank you, man. Again, for this wonderful spoon. Just give her a little dip. Just give her a little wipe. Um, got my uh, my merch. You know, I got my uh, my shirts here now. My Banana Man's Condiments. Um, you know, Banana Man's Condiments, Banana Man's Fire. That's me, the Banana Man. This is Jeffrey. He is not the Banana Man, in case you were wondering. Uh, chocolate primatale. Let's go. All right, let's do jigsaw red first. Let's do jigsaw red first because I know what the prima I know what the primatale is. I, I know what's coming for that. So let's. Ooh boy, that smells hot. Um, it's got a very typical red pepper smell. Not really fruity, but sweet. Reminiscent of very, 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 very ripe tomatoes. Almost like overripe tomato. So, um, you know, the, oh boy, there's a, that's a big piece right there. Oh no, it's not, it's just sort of stuck together. I am going to pull that out though. That big piece of placenta, that's just going to get stuck in my teeth. Set that aside. Put more powder. I'm not, I'm not going to skimp here. We'll still do a spoon. A little spoon. All right, here we go. Jigsaw red. Wow, instantly hot. Like the moment it touched my tongue. Oh, this is gonna be a good one. Hmm. Um not a bad flavor though. Just letting it sort of sit and hmm. Wow. That's impressive. Um, so I'm getting lots of heat. Ooh, man. Wow. Woo. Yeah. Intense heat. Everywhere. Oh man. Oh, oh excuse me. Intense heat everywhere it's touching. Um, 
not like crazy. Wow, the hiccups with this one are crazy. Not overwhel overwhelming, but definitely giving me the freaking hiccups, man. Goodness. Um, all of the heat at once. Just like all of it, all at once. As soon as it hit my tongue, right there on my tongue, just boom. Flavor, again, very reminiscent of almost just a very ripe tomato. Um, <clears throat> oh. Let me try to get rid of these hiccups real quick. It's like a very ripe tomato. Um, savory, but sweet. You know, like a sweet savory sort of flavor. Ripe savory, maybe, the way to put it. I'm not sure. I'm not great with words. Sometimes I'm okay with them. Um, no bitter flavor at all. No floral at all. The heat, I'm going to say, is like a good... I'm going to give it probably... Um, I'm going to give it a, a 3 out of 5 bananas. I'm not going insane. But it, it did take me by surprise. Um, my eyes are watering up pretty good here. I don't know if you can see that. But man. Um, yeah. Yeah, it's about three out of five bananas. Um, not insane, but just everywhere it's touching. Hot, 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 hot. Crazy hot. Um, just not even dying down anywhere I touch in my mouth. So let's let this ride out for a minute and see how it goes. How are you doing today, Jeffrey? I haven't seen you all day. Been busy with work. How have you been? Have you been good? Would you like some Jigsaw Red? It might be hard to you, with you to uh, to eat it, you know, only having teeth that go straight from your upper lip to your your lower lip, your you know, your upper jaw, lower jaw, with no like no split in them. I don't know. I don't know. So I'm getting my typical sinus reaction that I get, you know, eyes, nose, running sort of thing. Typically happens for me with all the hot, hot chinensis. Um, I would compare this to it's not as hot as the Primatali. I would say that the Primatali one, if I were to re-rate that on my new scale, would be about three and a half, four bananas out of five. Um, this one is not there, excuse me real quick, let me just blow my nose. Uh. So, but it, uh, it's unique in how it just, everywhere it's touched my mouth is just blazing. No, no fruitiness, no floralness, no bitterness. Um, sweet, ripe vegetables, tomatoes, really ripe red peppers. It has like that kind of sweet flavor, but not, not, uh, not, not quite as sweet as like a sweet pepper, but that going that direction and just insanely hot everywhere. It's touching my mouth. Goodness. Uh, anyway. That was the Jigsaw Red. Let's do the Chocolate Primatale, which I'm not looking forward to, honestly. Um, so, like I've said, the Chocolate Primatale is sort of bitter um, in, in my experience with it. This powder, when I tried it, it was sort of bitter. Now, it smells good. It smells like, um, hmm, like instant coffee. Ah, come out, tear. Let me wipe you. Um, sort of like instant coffee. So, maybe it has, like, some of the similar chemicals as coffee. So, let's do a little bit here. Just a little bit of this one, because it, it really, it's, to me, it's very bitter. 
It smells really good though. Um, it might be good in like a chili where, you know, it's mixed in. Um, it does have a smokiness to it, which I appreciate. Let me try to get the rest of this jigsaw out of my mouth. sort of clean itself here might cut some of this out i might fast forward i might not who cares who knows might just send it um i always i tend to send it but i'd like to be able to differentiate the flavors for these for you guys so oh. so jimmy does do the isolated the mosquito net isolated grows um I've always gotten all my deliveries on time. Really, you know, answers you, really helpful. So, all right. Let's see what we got here with this uh, chocolate prima tolly. So yeah, the Jigsaw Red in quick review, while the rest of this burn is just sort of coming down, um, it has that, that three out of five bananas on heat. I'm going to say three out of five bananas on flavor, too. Pretty good. Um, not my favorite super hot. But, alas. All right. The heat just, it just does this. It just, it goes, whoop. This is on the jigsaw. Just whoop. Whoop. That's, it just, it was just like a, a completely flat plateau, so. All right, a little bit of chocolate primatale powder here. Let's go. Oh, oh, it's it's like really smoky. Oh, oh man, and really bitter, which are two things I'm not super duper fond of, personally. Um, yeah, it's it's bitter to me. And just has like a lingering sharp bitterness. Um, it's it's not really floral. Sitting here, really thinking about it. Um, the heat is probably just about the same as the jigsaw red. Honestly, this is this brought that burn right back to the same place, and it's just sort of there. Let me get a little water. Hmm. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Activated a little bit there. Um, oh, oh. yeah. Uh, yeah. Just maybe a, a little bit less hot. I did just eat the jigsaw red. I understand, but this one isn't burning nearly as bad. Um, it's not my favorite flavor, but it is a nice burn. Um, just a little bit of this would add a great kick, like I said, to like a chili or something you want that smoky flavor in. But yeah, I get a, I get a bitterness that just sort of overwhelms anything else besides the smokiness that I can taste. The heat is decent. Um, I'm going to give it, I'm going to give it two I'm going to give it two and three quarter out of five bananas on heat. Um, flavor, I'm going to give it one out of five bananas. I'm not a big fan of the flavor of this pepper. Um, we'll, we'll keep trying it. You know, I'm growing the plants. So, whew, that is a good burn. It is a good burn. Um, mostly a tongue burn and a cheek burn on the Prima Tali, the chocolate Prima Tali. Yeah, and there's not really much else I can say about that. So I'm sort of glad I did the Jigsaw Red first because um, the Chocolate Prima Tali is, you know, it, you should check out my my buddy Nelson Chaney over at Craving Cap Saison. He actually has a fresh pod review of the Chocolate Prima Tali. So I think that that would be 
maybe a better review to go check out. Mm-hmm. There's also a bunch of people that have done reviews on them. The Fresh Pod. I'm sure you could find reviews on Jigsaw Red. Every, you know, I'm just about every pepper out there has been reviewed. This is nothing new, but... <clears throat> mm. Man, oh man. That's all I really got to say. Uh, the Jigsaw Red, I might have to try to get some of those seeds. The Chocolate Primatale, I'm already growing. So, I'll check back in with some fresh pods and do a fresh pod on one of those probably and let you know what I think. When, uh, when the plants are, are putting pods out good, which hopefully should be pretty, pretty soon. I'm in Florida, so my season is, you know, my end of season is pretty short. I had them going really early. I lost a bunch of them to some unexpected cold, but I managed to save a few of them. So yeah, I will check back in on those. The jigs are red I don't have, but if I can get a pod, I'll try to. But anywho, I'm ranting at this point. I've already taken up a bunch of your time. If you've watched, I appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, I'm Banana Man. I am on fire. These are these are good burners. These are good burners. They're not... Uh, oh, man. Woo. Um, they're not what I would consider, like... They're not five out of five bananas. That's how we're going to put it. So, anyway, thank you guys if you've watched this. I love you guys. Have a great night. Have a great day. Have a great morning. Have a great afternoon. Have a great life. Please. If not for me, for you. So, let me know what you guys think. Uh, let me know what you guys want to see. I'm really open to do whatever here. I'm working on this pizza tutorial video, which has turned into a much bigger and harder to complete project with two children and without a dedicated sound booth um, and only a desktop computer. So, I digress. That'll be out soon, I promise. But yeah, let me know what you want to see here. Uh, if you want to see more challenge stuff, you want to see this, you want to see that, you want to see who, whatever. Again, I'm Banana Man. I'm on fire. Have a great night, guys.